championship is, has taken off already for you this year um, with your victory over Kildare last week. A lot of people in the under-21 championship, a lot of people would have thought there was a close victory. Um, talk to me about the game. Yeah, we, we went up there under no illusions that Kildare were a, a good side. I think they were underestimated a lot by, by the outer public, but we, we knew their strengths and we knew how good they were and, and they, they proved how good they were. Um, you know, they got lads behind the ball and they were well able to use the ball up front as well. So. Eventually we, we broke them down and we ended up coming out with a, a good uh, convincing victory in the end, so thank God. Yeah. With a personal tally of 12 points, um, I just heard there that you were also put on free-taking duty. Do you feel the pressure on your shoulders because you come from the senior squad to the under-21s? No, I don't, I don't really feel the pressure. Um, you know, you go to and enjoy every game you play and that's what, everything, that's what these young kids are probably going to be uh, told every time they go out to play and it's, it's the same as you grow up and the same as you go up the levels, you go up the teams. I go out and enjoy every game and, and um, I, coming from a senior setup is not really no different. You know, it's, there's lads in the under 21 setup as well who are well able to deal with a bit of expectation and a bit of pressure so it's not, it's not really a, a major issue. You were unlucky in the league, um, having broken your foot. Was it your ankle earlier yeah. on this year? How how did you find that? You know, and, and in terms of young players who might be um, struggling with an injury at the moment, what would your words of advice be to them? Well, my my, li my little piece of advice would probably be just you know, don't don't give up on something just because something bad has happened. Like, um, you know, if you have a, if you get a knock or you, you get a break or, or get any sort of injury, even if you suffer a, a defeat. A, a heavy defeat, you know, it's all it's all in part and parcel of the game, and, and once you're enjoying in your game, you, you won't be long about wanting to get back and, and doing everything you can to get back as quick as you can. So that's what I did anyway, and thankfully the lads have done an awful lot of work with me, and uh, you know I, I was willing to do as much as I could to, to try get my try get my place uh, come championship and come to the end of the league. Yeah, just in terms of the senior championship that's coming up, uh, you know, you've, you're facing Westmead. Um, any thoughts on that game? Yeah, well, it's it's you know I, I, we we're kind of treating every game as an all the final for us. You know, every every team we're trying to analyse every team we play and and try to think of our own ways to play each team. And um, you know, we will we'll take they're absolutely flying at the moment. You know, they've they've probably shocked an awful lot of people with their own robin uh, performances that they've put in. So we'll um, we'll have to be really on our, our, our top performance to to try um, to try topple them. Yeah, and just in terms of um, the championship, you know, looking at Limerick and Clare last weekend, I think everybody it's on everybody's lips or whatever. Any thoughts on that game or the outcome? Yeah, I thought that was a great game. Um, the first half was kind of a bit cagey, but as expected, it's the first game of the year. You're trying to suss out the opposition. That's that's all that's really going to happen in your first couple of minutes of your, your first uh, championship game. But... I think I think both sides, you know, as it opened up in the second half, really showed the, the class and the, that they have. And you know, for example, young Keen Lynch there, you know, he, he put in a great display, and it just shows that you know it doesn't matter once you're once you're good enough, you, you're old enough. And you know, to be fair to Liam, he he's done that as well for, with us over the years. So 